sitting or lying comfortably with your spine straight. Begin breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. Allowing your body to relax. And coming into stillness within. And in your readiness, I invite you to set an intention inside to access the highest level of love that you can reach. Just begin breathing in the energies of loving. Breathing in your own loving essence. Filling your heart center with love. And then breathing that loving all the way down to your toes. Filling up your cells, breathing in loving, flooding your whole body with loving, breathing the loving all the way down to your fingertips and all the way up through to the top of your head until you can see, sense, feel, imagine every cell in your body lit up with loving. And then set an intention to access the highest level of compassion that you can reach. And begin breathing in compassion. That energy that says it's okay, it's all right. That holds when suffering is present with so much love. Flood your heart center with compassion. And then breathe that compassion all the way down to your toes, filling up every cell in your body with compassion, taking the compassion all the way down to your fingertips and all the way through your body, up through the top of your head until you see, sense, feel, imagine every cell in your body flooded with the warmth of compassion. And from this place of love and compassion, I invite you now to take a look at how you have responded to fear thoughts. Noticing if you have tried to avoid, deny, negate, deflect, brush under the rug, criticize, berate, ignore, or any other tactic. How have you responded to your own fear-based thinking internally? And your fear thoughts are a part of you and they are deserving of your compassion. Every part of you is okay and worthy of being treated kindly, gently, lovingly. And I want you now to begin to see your fear thoughts as like a young child 
and you could imagine yourself as a nurturing parent or caregiver to that young child. And if a child is scared and crying, you might picture yourself kneeling down and reaching out your arms and saying, come here, sweetie, it's okay. It's all right. You're okay. You're safe. I've got you. Rocking that child, soothing that child, flooding that child with compassion, creating a sense of safety, of warmth, of love and caring. And this can become a new pattern for you. How you respond internally to your own fear-based patterns of thinking. When you can listen from a place of infinite compassion, miracles will begin to occur. Your fear-based thinking will share how it's feeling and why and will provide you with valuable information about what beliefs you've been buying into. And in that moment, you have the power to update those beliefs from a place of compassion. Going from fear-based irrational thinking into rational, love-based thinking. And if this resonates with you, I invite you to repeat after me. I forgive myself for buying into the irrational belief that it serves me in any way to respond with fear-based thinking with criticism, denial, avoidance, deflection, fill in the blank, whatever you use. And letting that go and seeing a new pattern for yourself where from now on you respond internally to your own fear-based thinking with love, with gentleness, with compassion and you have the ability to respond this way every time a fear-based thought arises. See yourself treating yourself kindly from here on out, responding with compassion from within. My updated belief is And breathe that in. And I invite you now to spend a few moments visualizing this new pattern, this compassionate response to your own fear-based thinking. Many blessings of joy and vibrant freedom.